Hello, hello. Welcome back to Hearthstone Homebrew. My name is AJ. Uh, today we are going to try something a little different. We are at the rank floor of Diamond 5. I tried climbing off screen with, uh, what was it? A big elemental shaman? That was not going very good. Trying to juice up all the elementals with Therizane and uh, Lorthamotheron. And it did not work. Surprise, surprise. It was actually pretty good into Death Knight though. They just had a hard time dealing with the humongous stats. Every other deck just ran me over. Warrior playing Solitaire, and then Warlock just doesn't care. It just kills you. <laughs> so um, I played a lot of Warriors when I was playing that matchup, and I was thinking, well, my favorite deck to play back in the day was, against the Solitaire playing Warriors, was the um, little bit of Fatigue uh, Warlock with Rin, Orchestrator of Doom. So with that deck... I probably won one or two out of ten matches. It was absolutely terrible, and it still is probably absolutely terrible. But I did double down a lot, double and triple down a lot on the Rin effect. So you're just kind of hoping to draw Rin. And I'm thinking if you build a deck with Rin as kind of a supplement, it might be better rather than the whole package. So we have a lot going on in this deck. We have a whole bunch of uh, like life gain to help us stay in it. Chaotic Consumption, Felstring Harp. Dirty Wrath for Disruption, Crescendo to, to juice up Fatigue damage. I want to throw a second Baritone Imp in here, probably helps fight the early game, helps juice up your Fatigue. Then we have Geo to draw a Greedy Partner. We have 15 2-drops, it didn't just make sense. Shallow Grave to trigger Rin. Um, maybe we can snipe something kind of similar to a Dirty Wrath. Watcher of the Sun for some healing, and also helps us play our boy Ignis. Um, encouraging Insanity, that's that combo. You can do Encouraging Insanity, Lady Darkvane, and then Shallow Grave, one of the minions. And then if you have a Void Virtuoso down, they're taking a whole bunch of fatigue damage. You can also do Lady Darkvane and Defile to pop them. There's a lot of cool synergies. Popgar for the full heat with Crescendo, and he's just a good overpowered minion. Uh, we have the Finale package in here with Elite Tar and Chieftain. And then you make it so that they can't play the, uh, unless they have a 10 mana spell, of course, but you make it so that they can't, uh, oh no, it's all their cards, never mind. So they can't play it next turn. If it gets up to 30 or 28, this is a pipe dream, don't get me wrong. But it's a fun uh, little two card combo to include in your deck. Dark Vein for the combo, Rin is kind of the fatigue piece. Symphony, always a good card, maybe you can snipe six of their cards. Twisting Nether at the top end, Sargeras and Yogg's are on. A lot of stuff going on in this deck. Um, we're going to try it out over 10 games. If we win two, I'll be happy. You know what? But it's a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Mill lock. Haha. -ha. Uh, mill fatigue. I'm going to be happy when Warlock gets nerfed. And then I can just play uh, Warlock without being feeling guilty. <laughs> I have almost every single legendary for this class. Except, uh, the one I want. I think it's a Loken, Jailer of Yogg-Saron. Alrighty, we have a decent, decent. And it's probably just a box standard, uh, Little fatigue guy here, or uh, not fatigue, sludge, a sludge buddy. We'll just put him down to start fighting for early board. Excuse me. Oh, that's an early fracking. Um, we like defile. Ooh, yeah, let's snipe that. No sludge value for you, young man. Watch him have a second one in hand. And that was our coin, but... Okay, that's fine. Well... Yeah, it's the 4 mana 7-7. Seven, seven. Uh, we don't really have an answer to that just yet. The 
curvature is upon us. All right. That's not a bad card to grab. A lot of board clears. Maybe it's worth running uh, two mana, one, one, spell damage, blood mage. There you go, blood mage, Thalnus. <laughs> I swear, my memories. It's there. All right. Um, We just need a one. And we can bring this all down to size. We could probably fatigue and defile. It sucks to uh, use two board clears like this, but that's the best way to get rid of this. Oh, 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 uh, well, whatever. Yeah, I should have crescendoed first. I don't know what I'm thinking. Having two defiles down does not feel good, but I think that's both of his stuff. Alrighty. We need to start taking some fatigue damage. Alright, that will help. But uh, he's a little bit later. Sure. Give us a coin. So we have two crescendos for free. Yeah, it's probably worth throwing the uh, baritone imp in here. And now the premiere act. Me. He's taking a lot of fatigue damage. Ah! Alright, thankfully we can heal up a good bit here. run out of cards. Oh, I don't think I've seen this list before. Ooh, let's see if we can get the deal five or deal six to all. That would be perfect. We did not, so <laughs> it's not looking good for the home team. Probably deal six just so we live here. That would have been perfect, but uh, it doesn't always work out that way. Uh, we can heal up a lot, though, if we don't die here. Okay... So much damage, bro. Or so much healing, but I don't know. He survived a re rebound. I'm just looking for some kind of fatigue damage, y'all. Uh, I think having the defile there would have been good. Could have cleaned this up, no problem. Ah, <sighs> misplay leads to me losing the game. I wonder if he's going to leave Popcorn up. No, okay. I need some cards, brother, brother, brother. Deal 6 to all would have been good, too. Anything. Anything in the box, please. Oh, now you want to show up. Nine, fourteen, nineteen? Pretty close. We're just dying. I think
think I had this. I just was a little too, uh, oh yeah, that's it. 10, 19. And I think that put me in 18, yeah. Uh, wasting that defile there was probably what did me in. Alrighty. <laughs> First loss, but that was more on me than anything. This is a good combo. Maybe we just double down, double and triple down on the fatigue package, take out some other elements. But then it's just more of a fatigue warlock than anything. Could be worth trying though. Who knows? Fatigue warlock with disruption. I don't know if it's any good, but it's probably a lot of fun. <laughs> uh, let's just keep tapping. Throwing the tour guide in here could be good too. Yes, 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 we know. Yet another warlock, or yet another uh, plague death knight. <laughs> Oh, that's fine. I haven't seen them run that card, to be honest. Ah, uh, drawing all this crap, man. Alright, that at least helps me clear up some of it. I am pretty low though, just from taking smacked on the face. Uh, let's tap. And we will defile. It's probably right in uh, throwing some more fatigue stuff in here, because getting up to a nice crescendo and then dropping a whole bunch of imps is another uh, is another angle we could go. Super low. I'm getting pretty low. I want him to have more minions on the board before I go crescendo, though. Ooh, that is perfect. Well, that's a lot of healing. Um, well, we're gonna overdraw something. Unfortunate, but just gotta roll with it. Healed up a lot there, what was that? Ten HP? We need to get some actual cards, though. <laughs> it's just a bunch of removal. Just a bunch of removal. That art, the signature art for the Cobalt Miner is pretty cool. I 
Uh, our opponents run some spicy stuff. Okay. Um, maybe we get a nice five mana weapon. Or should we go? For, we'll go for the ten. Maybe we can blow them out with a uh, yeah, a whole bunch of these minions. That's a dangerous minion. Uh, so let's get rid of the Frost Plague. Oh, I just realized, uh, that's a good reverb target. Maybe we have to hold off on that, unfortunately. Yeah, and we couldn't uh, do it if we wanted. Oh, come on with this mess, man. <laughs> Alright, um, we can just go in with the Runic Great Mace regardless. Kind of going to have to, right? Our gift of the arcane enlightens us. Our gift of frost shields us. Yeah. We get some good 8 drops. We're taking a good bit of damage here. Um, is Sargeras worth just to soak up? Probably. Soak up some Astalor shenanigans. He might uh, Primus here, and that'll give us some time. That's fine. Doesn't really benefit him much. Uh, let's just go in. We kind of have to go. Alrighty. We are a little low, but we, we had to do it. He's probably... Has he got Reska here? All his good cards. Uh, it's gonna be a, a thing, right? Yeah. I suppose it's fine. Oh, one many Yolks are on? I'll take it. I need healing. Too many Yawks are on. Come on now. Alright, we gotta... We got a win here, pretty much. Oh. I think 
it just sit, right? One and one. Uh, not that uh, ETC did anything there, but that was fun. Um, we probably want another Baritone Imp in here, for sure. What do we take out for that? I like the Armor Vendors to stay alive. Commander Ulthok. Yeah, this is just a fun combo. I don't know if it's doing any good. Twisting Nether. Some Against Dragon Druid, Twisting Nether can be really good. Uh, let's take it out. And go with... Another baritone imp. Juice up to fatigue, have some early game. Watch me face a dragon druid right after this. And we lose. Because <laughs> we didn't have twisting other. Death Knights. Uh, Defile may be useful later. We get a coin here. Nice little early curve. We need some draw, but we can get there. We're a warlock, right? That's what we do best. The one mana draw guy, Tor God, also helps you juice up Defile. So he's almost always probably worth including in a warlock deck. 40 card warlock, especially. A new evil plan. I need to think of a better way to use this. Maybe there's a better way to get a nice death rattle down. Does Warlock have any good death rattles? Elementium Geode will help you draw a little bit. It's not that great, but it's something. My plague, or something like that, every time. Is this the second or third Death Knight we face? Oh, there we go. Every time. Does everybody net deck the same thing? I am in Diamond Five, so I can't complain. This is this is the place to do it. Maybe we can get something down here. Uh, it's it's scary, but. Maybe we can catch it in a defile. Should have just drawn. Drawn. Oh, perfect. Before we draw, because we could draw a Frost Plague. Alrighty. Geode's good. Could drop the Virtuoso Geode and uh, tap. Nice little tempo play from our opponent. He's going in. Probably gets a... Corrupted Ashbringer would be a good bet for him. Heal up, smack me in the face. Um, hmm. I like this. Y'all get something for later. We have a little healing here. Could do our little combo. <laughs> Though I don't know how good it's going to be into a Death Knight. Maybe we want to save up for a, a Y'all clear. Crescendo's good. 
Where's all our fatigue guards? Okay. Looks like we do want to save up for that. Alrighty. Maybe we should just drop her in, suck up six damage. We do heal a little bit, but it's probably not gonna be enough. You have earned okay. eternity of torment. It wasn't Hellion four, you know. We'll take it. Maybe we can get a we need something. That heals us, unironically. Uh, this will do two to everything. And that's not really clearing anything. Maybe we go here, see what we can find in one. Poisonous deal to it all? Or deal one all? I will take it. You made me do this. We'll do this, heal up a little bit. And then see what he pops down. Smart man, knowing he's got a trade. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Um, just go rain, I guess. Goodbye, Yoxeron. Goodbye, Frost Plague. Goodbye, that. A little bit of healing's good. Goodbye, Blood Plague. Ah, I would have loved Symphony. Oh, well. Let's forge this. He's gonna be smacking us in the face here in a second. Uh, maybe we can draw a pop card. We have a lot of. Um, give me all your spells, bud. Thank you. Damn. I like Death Knight when it doesn't have this kind of damage. It's hurting. Can you feel the gift of the sun? So we can clear here. Uh, and we can also clear here. But he just drew a ton of cards. hate doing this. Yeah, because I want to save it for... Maybe we draw a pop card? Oh my god. Hopefully we don't die here. I don't remember. Okay, we're just taking one.
that was a lot of healing. I guess I didn't have no room in my hand even after... I thought I spent all my coins there. Probably worth including some of the uh mm -hmm. We're not real clear really. Let's see if we can rat out something. Well that's good, but I'm not really gonna change anything. We can reverb this, and then it's gonna live. But he has, uh... Yeah, he's gonna have Astalor come down. One and two. Ah, can we face something other than Plague Death Knight? Find out at 11. Uh, the file may be useful for some of their early stuff. Keep the dirty rat. It's funny, off camera I was playing like three warriors in a row here. Nothing but Plague Death Knight. <laughs> I thought about making it a 40 card Reno list. Ooh. Alright. Well, we will sit here and defile if he drops something else. Let's kill that. Try to get a spark bot there, but uh, cannot let him live. Oh, that sucks. That's what you get when you play Dirty Rat. Sometimes it just happens. Not looking good for the home team. That's better. Rogue with Drilly? Still, uh, I mean, it makes sense, actually. I think this should be enough. One. Uh, I need a two in here, though. One. And that's not going to die because of the Divine Shield, so yeah, we probably need a Crescendo. Is he just an excavate rogue with a mech package? Quick draw and drilly, his mech rogue with a full hand feels good. So that needs to die. What's in the dark name? Defile? Sure. I mean, Defile here is okay, but it doesn't... I hope we don't die to a humongous magnetize. Oh god. 
Well, that's my fault. Should have cleared that. Ah, uh, Mechrug. One and three. Let's face some warriors. And even then, we don't win against warrior. I guess we'll take the the wins we can get two and three ish all right that doesn't really count but uh <laughs> improve the win rate a little bit Uh, we probably don't need to keep Rad, actually. Dark Vein. Drop a Dark Vein with a Defile in it. That's not bad. Four cheer. This must be a new list. Okay. I think I might take out ETC for uh, a little bit more early game. All right, it's a big minion, and it's got rush, so I can uh, I can reverb that which is most likely worth it. Okay. Can't interact with that minion, unfortunately. Can you feel the gift? I was looking good here. Still looking fine here. Yeah. Well, we just drew our, our removal here, I guess. Not looking too bad. Yeah, it's probably good to get Dark Vein down just to fight for the board. Let the ritual of absolution commence. Those two defiles are going to be clutch. Uh, I kind of wish I had a two for a Greedy Partner here, but you know, what can you do? Then I could drop down Sargeras. I wonder what he's going to do. This looks like a bot name. You know, who, who names their character this? Y-L-O-F-Z-J-390-Q-I-B. Is that a real name? Am I tripping? Okay. Does it start out stealth? It does. Uh, annoying. Thankfully, Popcar is broken.
We uh we drew every good removal tool that we have, so uh <laughs> got lucky there, I guess. Why would you let me kill it like that, you know? Uh, yeah, let's just clear the whole board, whatever. Throw down the partner just to have someone on board. Probably better to tap there since our gears is sending whatever they have back home. Yeah, Sargeras, and let's put up some taunts. We'll see what else he plays, maybe we can get a better Twisting Nether. Sargeras is such a good Titan, I love playing this card. A uh, Reno list with Sargeras and uh, Reno, feels pretty good too. Uh, he got some pretty, those are nice mechs. Oh yeah, let's let's twist another of that. It's cute, Rogue, but uh there is no escape. See the world is not So this combo is cool, but uh we pretty much already won the game, so it's kind of a win more combo. <laughs> Maybe we take it out. We'll play another uh six games. Is that is Mechro bot bot worthy? Seems like it, it has some play to it. Can't just mindlessly pilot it. Alright, three and three. Technically it'd be two and three, but uh we're gonna take that concede as a uh, a sign, you know. We've been favored. We like some early game. Uh, Symphony's okay, but I don't think it's what we're looking for. We want Defile. Ugh. Elite Tar and Chieftain, buddy. I don't think you're doing it. Perfect. I was going to coin out the greedy partner, but maybe we don't need to. Zoo, zoo, zoo. I don't like doing a one mana crescendo, but uh, I also don't like taking five damage from a one drop. <laughs> Insane, bro. We could coin here. I'm thinking uh, saving the Yogg Saron. Then again, we're not really doing anything. Let's coin, see if we can get something. Okay. Uh, coining a Symphony of Sins. That could be useful. 
Boogie down. Paladin that's trading. What is this, bro? Um, well. One, two, three. It clears everything. And then Lady Darkvane's gonna have the files in it, so if he reloads, that's... But we're just gonna drop it, why not? Alright. We're gonna take some damage here, that's fine. We can heal up a bit. Unless he has the, uh... Shroom Scavate Garden's Grace combo. Giving Paladin. Ooh, that's. Uh, that's not good, but it's not absolutely terrible. Ow. <laughs> Be paid. Alright, heal it up a good bit. Maybe we can get the uh, 6 damage board clear. Oh, come on now, another one. Let's see what's in the symphony. Ah, none of these really do anything, bro. Whatever. Goodbye, Countess, I guess. Uh, maybe he'll soak up some damage and then we can yog. I should have probably tapped. <laughs> should have probably tapped. Shroom Scavate, Garden's Grace, yeah. Just couldn't clear the Paladin minions, and we die. Alrighty. Two, or three and four. Okay, we'll take out the uh, little two-man combo there. It's it's good in theory, but I think we're just dying too early to do anything. And plus we have the other fatigue stuff to, to mess around with. Maybe we throw two craze conductors in there. How much board clear are we working with? We got our mortal eradications. I mean, a hellfire is not a bad idea. It's just uh, a lot of stuff that's got. Trog Gem Tosser could be good as well. Let us play with the two. Two Craze Conductors. It's not a board clear, but it does give us stuff to trade with. And it creates a board. Which makes our solitaire opponents have to do something. Ah, surprise, surprise. A Death Knight. down, start tapping away. Coin, uh, down with the ship, probably. A plague strike. Interesting. We'll tap, or we'll, uh, forge here. My pain doesn't compare to your plague.
we'll do that to uh, have a little bit more help to play around with. Or heal up with Watcher of the Sun. Alright, we can create a good defile here, yeah. Not the best defile, but... Um, Clear some stuff up. Ooh, that's a good holy spell to get. Uh, Rin Shallow Grave. <laughs> that's how it's looking like our play. Is this uh hell you off the top? No. We just play Rin to play Rin. What are we gonna shallow grave then? Maybe a, uh... The sun incinerates you. Yeah, whatever. The sun incinerates you. Maybe we can make him overdraw. Or throw out. Hell yeah. <laughs> People need to take a second to read Rin. It's like, what the hell does this card do? I have never seen this card before. It's like a plague rainbow list, maybe. Yeah. Uh, so I can silence these guys. Do they have any other worthwhile silences? I don't think so. Bella Doom. Let's do it. This is so bad, tempo wise. Ooh, we love Ignis. Goodbye, Ignis. My plague. A symphony of darkness. The sun incinerates you. Uh, so we can get a one minute Ignis weapon, maybe. What did he discard? Uh, Sylvanas, a plague, a lot of draw. Wasn't too good. Uh, we probably want to go one mana. That's fine. Adjacent minions and deal two. I would love poisonous AoE, but can't always get it. Why wouldn't you just swing one time and then... I mean, I understand getting the fresh weapon down. You worried about weapon destruction, maybe? I would love some kind of board clear here. Sure! Probably should have, uh... Swung first, but uh, you know what? We don't make mistakes here. I'm running this card, man. I spicy list from our opponent. Let's go, Sargeras off the top.
All right. <laughs> I don't wonder what the odds of that are. They seem a little better. I need to get these guys killed. I want their value from them. Feels like a bot, you know? Is botting really that prevalent in standard? Uh, okay, well, we can at least get one of them killed. Give some draw, maybe. There is our boy. So help us not have to deal with friends. Um, so if I do this, I could potentially take out, yeah, everything but the cow is gonna be left up. We are getting pretty low. Um, let's chaotic consumption just to preserve health. Ugh. That does not not look good for the home team. Maybe just run steam cleaner in here for all the death knights we're facing. It doesn't it's not even a good car really, right? Arcane Defenders? Sure. Um, you get a reverb on a, uh, a Primus would be cool. It's also cool, I guess. I want to get a harp or some kind of more healing. I feel like we have tons of healing in this deck. take fatigue damage <laughs> unfortunate nuts are gears Let's see what's in the box here. Uh, this doesn't really stop him from hurting us. Feels like we're just gonna have to Sargeras here. Put up some more taunts. He's gonna be able to clear it. Uh, Feels like a knee-jerk reaction from me. But these don't really do anything. No taunts or anything. I don't like doing that. We probably just drop Sir, or, uh, Astolor anyway. Maybe we should include Astolor. Fair enough. Uh, 
Take two, then we're gonna have... It feels weird to do this. But it does give us a nice uh, defile. Everything but him. Uh, yeah, okay. I don't know what I could have done differently there. Maybe... I don't think I had a minion down anyway. Maybe, I don't know, saving that Astalor, or saving that uh, 3 and 5, saving that Sargeras. It's like every opponent's running plays, Highlander decks are really feeling left out. All right, a warrior. Let the crystals claim your mind. Wonder what uh, control-ish warlocks are playing right now. It's probably like some variant of Rena, right? There's a million sledgeless, my god. Yeah, control warlock's not looking too hot right now. The curse warlock's not bad then. Bro. How could they not have seen this coming with nerfing everything but sledge? They bust sludge for like two two times in a row. Alright, we need to get tapping. If it's a warrior, tap away. Put your yodes fine. Get to our dirty rats and stuff. Oh, that's a nice little uh, deny of his draw. Um, let's armor vendor and do this. We cannot likely kill something that comes out of that, but maybe we should juice up the Odin. Has he coined yet? I feel like he. I don't know. I feel like this is maybe the uh, draw a million cards list. Whatever. Not the best, not the worst. This is probably Blade Storm. Yeah. Ooh, remove top six. Oh, come on. Come on. Maybe we should have gone for draw six. Chance to draw Ren. Watch us overdraw Ren there. <laughs> yeah, Warlock, a warrior opponent playing Solitaire. You either kill him or you try to disrupt him. And uh, it's not always guaranteed. They have a lot of redundancy. A lot of. Is that a shield slam? Yeah. In 
So much draw on this list, my god. Whose bright idea was to get Warrior all this draw? I probably should just pick the draw six, just to filter through my deck some more. He's dropping Odin next turn, most likely. The time has come to to our master. Uh, we can do encroaching and sin if we have a. Uh... No, he has forty-five health. I was gonna say if he, we have a. Um, sit. The immune guy, one mana, one three immune guy. Orchestrator. I can't remember. It's it's too many names, too many Hearthstone cards. Amuse me. There he is. Interesting. He doesn't swing there. It's better to. Is this the OTK? 35? I think it is. OTK, and it's got uh, Bran and Boom Boss and Astolor. I feel like this is the refined list. Ow. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the OTK. Yeah, look at that. Crazy. We're actually running a lot of disruption, so... You know, sometimes it happens. I wonder if we cut it to a 30-card list. Um, how consistent our little disruption package would be. I'll try that off-screen. But uh, three and six, we're not always going to face disruption. I feel like it'll just turn more into a fatigue deck than anything. A uh, million death knights. I don't hate this. Dirty Rat may be a little bold. Trying to draw out how he is uh, interesting, but maybe not worth it. And we'll throw down the Harp. Harp Forge probably takes some damage. We'll throw down Rinnefall if we got nothing else to do. Tempo weapon on five. Sounds good to me. The time has come to our Spider life. tank, get him. This is a... Uh... Uh, I feel like Poisonous could be useful. None of these really heal us or do anything. Help and fight for the board is nice. Poisonous might help us take down a... Uh, a big golem. And then, yeah. His reign ends now. 
Hopefully we take some damage, and we can save up the Runic Axe for a rainy day. Alrighty. Good card, that. I'm glad I finally found some use, because it, it never really... I saw some use early when Frost was popular. Feels bad using this weapon for nothing. Maybe I should have dropped the Void. Void Virtuoso, there we go. Okay. He's going to draw a lot. I do want to get value out of this. All right, that's fine. Hooray, that was the perfect menu to draw. Get value out of our harp. Now we can drop this. Oh, and we don't take any damage. That's a, an interesting combo. Pop guard crescendo. What a what a four drop there. Big game hunter. Didn't he used to be three mana. We got Sargeras for later, help clear stuff up. We want to take some fatigue damage. I think he's worried if he drops his, uh... Corpse Bride, it's not gonna get much value. And I want to just keep him off the board till 9, because he's going to have some strong minions. Now oh, we have another play on 9. Let's tap, see what's in the box. Armor Vendor's fine. Perfect. He's probably just gonna resurrect that. Oh, okay. Got one more turn to keep him off the board. We got Popcar, Defile for Crescendo shenanigans. Wonder when he drops his giants and all that. It's kind of been slow for a rainbow aggro list. I don't even know if it's. It feels like it's rainbow, right? I've seen blood cards, frost cards, unholy cards. Um, do I want to save Void Virtuoso? Uh, let's see what's in the Dirty Rat. Okay, doesn't really do anything, but it's fine. Uh, 
I should have a uh, Crusader Aura to get a plus plus two plus one here. Mistake. But uh, that'll be fine. Get it out of the hand at least. This has been a good weapon. This poisonous. He drops. Uh, he's got to drop something, man. He's. I'm getting in my late game. He does have climactic necrotic explosion, I guess. It just feels like this deck runs you over before then. With 30, 30 worth of stats. I'd say the worst deck for that is Totem Shaman, dude. You clear like one board, and they do the uh, the infuse thing, and um. Then they drop three totem golems after that. Alrighty. I mean, I want to crescendo. Alright, I want to pop car. Yeah, why don't we just pop car heal a little bit? We'll save the crescendo, maybe. Uh, eight cards in hand. Yeah, we'll save it. He probably kills Popcar here, but won't be a bad thing to save. Maybe it does more later. Take control of that. Could also kill it, but uh, I don't fancy taking 9 damage. Do that in an Unholy, probably. Get some uh, minions. And he probably goes for a Corrupted Ashbringer. That's a big minion to steal. I think I like this actually. Let's us heal. Um, sure. We'll take a fatigue damage. It deals four damage because of the. Uh... Maybe I should just save that. Because it'll uh, last through the next turn. Yeah, that was the right play. I don't know what he does here. Double, uh... So wanna steal, uh... No. It's absolutely... Insane how much late game this is. This is this is the, probably the perfect mid range deck. Already. Oh, unlucky. <laughs> yeah, that deck has a uh, game from beginning to end. Four to six. Four and six. Uh, probably could have refined this list. I would say cutting it down to a 30-card list, maybe get to your disruption a little better to have chance against Warrior, and then slot in Fatigue and Board Clear elements. 
maybe your top end for um, late game. Then it looks more like a control war or control warlock. Somehow fit in Ignis in there. Maybe I'll come up with a 30 card list. Ignis and then Sargeras. Maybe you can cut Yogg's around. The mind control there felt really good. Uh, the heal is always good. You could probably cut, cut two greedy partner. But yeah, maybe we'll come up with a 30 card list next with um, uh, all the, the goodies of fatigue and then most of the, the rain package here. Until uh, until next time, this was AJ with Hearthstone Homebrew. This one was not that great, four and six, but it could definitely be refined. There's there's something here. If you can get warriors, import minions, they have so much redundancy though, it feels pretty good. But it's not always going to happen. Until next time, this was AJ with Hearthstone Homebrew. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment if you have a suggestion or something you want to see next.